Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Travel Tech. Now, ever wondered how you can make your car dashboard shine just like the way it was bought from the showroom? Well, you need not think further because I have just the right product for you guys. This is the Moto Max dashboard polish. Yes, you can use this polish in order to make your car dashboard shine and all of the glossy vinyl surfaces or the rubber surfaces of your car. It might be also the exterior surfaces and in this case, in my Honda WRV, I can also use it on the exterior black cladding also as that gives a really polished and a really shiny look. Now you can use this dashboard polish by yourself. It's very easy. It's very simple. And of course, it costs also very less. So if you are interested, interested in buying this product i am going to give you a link in the description of this video so just go ahead and click on the description and you can find a link to buy this and you can also check out the price which is very minimal so let's just go ahead and show you what exactly this uh, moto max dashboard polish is this dashboard polish is specially formulated to restore glass on vinyl rubber plastic surfaces and protect against uv rays also what happens is our car dashboard is usually exposed to direct sunlight through the windshield so applying this dashboard polish protects the dashboard from fading out it gives a layer of protection and also gives a shiny layer so that it reflects off most of the uv light and the quality of the dashboard layer stays very optimum and in a way where it doesn't get spoiled very easily or even after a very long time so this dashboard polish serves a dual purpose of providing a shiny finish and also protecting the layer wherever you are applying it so let's just go ahead and open up the box and see what are the contents inside so guys this is the dashboard polish bottle and along with the bottle they have provided a sponge right in the back so you can use this same sponge in order to apply the polish to whichever areas you want to apply it it's a easily openable so as you can see there is an opening right here so you just need to open up take out the sponge invert the bottle and apply it whichever area you're planning to get that glossy finish so it's a very small bottle and it's a very easy handy you can keep this in the car itself and whenever you feel the dashboard polish is down you can go ahead and apply this within a matter of few seconds to a minute or so so it's a very easily usable user friendly you don't need a professional help to do this and it costs also very less i think this is the best combination car accessory you can buy for your car and of course as i said earlier it's applicable for both bikes and cars and of course you can also apply this to the exterior areas the black cladding areas of your car it might be the mud guard or it might be the side rail whichever black cladding areas are there whichever rubber type of areas are there you can apply it there in order to get that wanted shiny finish and also protect that layer so guys, if you are interested in buying this, as I said, the link is in the description of this video. You can go ahead and click on that description. And also along with this particular product, I have made lots of videos on many of the car accessories which are very essential for us. And if you are interested in checking out or if you are looking for some car accessories for your car, I think you should go ahead and click on the description of this video. You can find a plethora of videos and of course the links to buy them in the description. So just go ahead and click on that. So right now let's just go ahead and show you how exactly this dashboard polish works, how you can use it, how you can apply it in your car and give your car that glossy finish. So let's just go ahead.
So guys, you just saw how easily you can apply this dashboard polish on the car dashboard of your car and of course to any other area such as the exterior areas also which I showed you wherever there is a black cladding of your car and in this case in our Honda WRV there is so much black cladding outside and if you apply this polish it gives you a very nice and a very glossy look and that black really shines through. So you can use this if you have a Honda WRV and of course if you have any other car as well this is going to be extremely useful and it of course also is useful for two wheelers as well wherever you need that polish wherever you need that shine and to protect it from the sunlight from the UV rays. So it's a very useful product it's a very nifty product. So before applying this polish to whichever areas which you are preferring just make sure you remember some of these points that you clean and dry the surface to remove any traces of dirt. Take the dashboard polish on the given foam applicator and using the applicator spread the polish evenly on the surface. For dull and faded surfaces two or more coats might be required. So if you are not satisfied with a single coat you can apply two or three coats to give you that really glossy and a really shiny finish. And of course make sure that the treated areas will be slippery so that you do not use it on the vehicle controls such as the pedal, steering wheel or the gear knob or the glass. So the applied areas become a bit slippery so make sure you apply it on the areas which you are not in contact with your hand all the time so that is one caution which you need to follow other than that there is no issue with this you can go ahead and buy this and start using it in your car and have a really nice feel and have a really nice look inside the car and of course on the outside as well so this is the video for today guys i hope you like this video and i'll be bringing out many more interesting such videos for our cars and of course i'll be bringing out many more accessories as well and also i would like to tell you i'm bringing out a special episode on the digipad the digipad we all love to hate and hate to love I'm bringing out a very special episode on the Digipad very soon. So make sure you are subscribed to the channel if you don't want to miss that video. And of course, if you like the effort that has gone behind in making this video, do give a thumbs up to this video and also comment below on how you found out this video to be. That's it guys. Thank you for watching and have a really nice day.